Hello, and welcome back to Dentures vs. Food, where I try to teach you how to eat with or without your dentures. Today, we are eating a really good little sandwich. I like to make my sandwiches on hamburger buns, but the most important part of today is the pickles. Because I struggled trying to figure out how to eat a pickle wedge. And I haven't done a video about it yet, but a few years back, I struggled. I could eat steak, I could eat chicken, I could eat candy bars, I could eat a plethora of foods. But the pickle wedge eluded me for some reason. It was my unicorn, it was my nemesis. No matter how hard I tried, I couldn't get it right. I could not bite through a pickle wedge. So I would end up cutting it up with a fork and eating it that way and resolving myself to thinking that that's it. I mean, I can eat sliced pickles, I can eat, you know, whole pickles, which I could. I could literally grab a whole pickle out of a jar, bite it into chunks, eat it like an apple or a carrot or a piece of celery, but I could not bite through a pickle wedge. And I tried and I tried and I tried. And one day I was trying again. And my bottom denture kept coming loose, kept coming up in the back. I kept getting little seeds under it. I kept getting frustrated because I had to close my mouth to put my denture back down, then try again. And no matter what I did, even trying to bite on one side, the denture would lift up on the other side. I'm busy making a video, if you don't mind. <laughs> Anyway, I finally got to the point where I put the pickle down and I thought, I'm doing the same basic things over and over and over again and cannot succeed at biting through this pickle. So I was trying to do it like everybody else, holding the pickle like this and trying to bite through it problem is your teeth go through the soft part, your top teeth go through the soft part, but the bottom part is the rind. And it's very tough to bite through and you can't really push on the pickle. And I couldn't figure out a way to use my finger to push on my, you know, I mean, I don't want to grab the pickle like this and get pickle juice all over my hand. So I couldn't figure out a way to do it. And I didn't want to push on the denture like this because that would look stupid. And then one day, I picked up the pickle out of anger, and I turned it upside down, and I went like this. Who knew? Just by turning the pickle at wedge upside down, Don't have to push on it. Don't have to push on your denture. As your bottom denture slices through the pickle, that holds your denture in the right position to continue your bite. I don't know if I can get you in here close enough to see this. Try it this way. Just like that. I was eating a pickle at a friend's house one day. And this particular friend was a new friend. And I hadn't talked about my dentures yet. They didn't know I had dentures. And I was eating a pickle. And they said, Why do you turn your pickle upside down? I said, Well, pickle is generally round. So just because you slice it into quarters, which way is upside down? Maybe this was the top of the pickle and the rind's supposed to be sticking up. And he laughed and he goes, No, seriously, why do you turn your pickle upside down? I said, I don't know. I just... That's, I just do it that way. It wasn't that I was trying to hide my dentures from him because I tell everybody I have dentures. 
I wanted to see how far he would push it. So he let it go for a few minutes, and then he asked me again. He says, it's really bugging me. Why do you turn your denture up, or why do you turn your pickle upside down? I've never seen anyone eat it like that. So I came back with a very quick response, and I said, I've been doing that ever since I've had teeth, or ever since I've had these teeth. And he goes, oh, I was just curious. And that was the end of it. I didn't say I've been doing it ever since I've had these dentures. I just said I've been doing that ever since I've had these teeth. So in his mind, I've been doing it my entire life. When in all actuality, I've only been doing it for a couple of years. Ever since I've had these teeth. I really enjoy a good pickle wedge with a sandwich. Now again, with biting through the sandwich I'm using my bottom lip and you can tell by watching me, zoom in here, if you were just sitting across the table from me, like you are right now, you can't tell I'm pushing on my denture with my bottom lip. The point of these videos is twofold. Well, threefold actually. One, if you're using adhesive, hopefully you can learn to get away from the adhesive. If you have good enough dentures to do that. Two, if you're using adhesive, hopefully you can learn how to eat correctly so your adhesive lasts much longer throughout the day. And three, not only am I teaching you how to eat correctly, I'm trying to teach you that even using these techniques, you're going to look as natural as anybody else when you're eating. Now maybe it doesn't look natural to somebody to turn the pickle upside down. But has a stranger ever really questioned, questioned you on how you eat? No? How many of your friends that don't know you wear dentures, how many of them have questioned how you eat? None? Again, lip technique. Push on the bottom denture. If you can bite through the pickle with the rind down, go for it. I personally can't. I have to bite it with the rind up. But, I don't have to push on the denture with my lip or my, I don't have to push on the denture at all. I just bite straight down like I'm putting my mouth to rest. I don't care what position it's in when I'm chewing it. And one more little secret. If you're going to
you're going to eat a sandwich and a pickle like this, and you're going to have chips on your plate, if you don't want your sandwich and your chips to get soggy, just triple fold a paper towel and lay your pickle on it. Lay your pickles on the paper towel. It'll absorb the juice, keep it from running all over your plate and making the rest of your food soggy. Okay. I don't think I need to sit here and let you watch me completely eat this whole meal. The lesson today was about pickles and how I eat pickles. Who's to say? Pickles round. Who's to say that wedge didn't come off the top and it's actually pointing up the way it's supposed to? <laughs> Alright, that's it for today. I hope you got something out of it. If you did, please give me a big thumbs up. It really helps promote the channel, and you know as well as I do, we're trying to help as many people out there as we can. So the more thumbs up we get, the more comments we get, the more shares we get, the more people that subscribe, the more the channel will be promoted to help other people get the help, excuse me, that they deserve. Alright, that's it for today's video. I hope you all have an absolutely amazing day. Enjoy your food, and I will see you in my next video.